The city of Kyle is lifting certain water restrictions. Now that's after about a year of those constraints and requests for conservation. KVU's Matt Fernandez joins us live from Kyle with how the city was able to make the changes and how residents there are feeling today. Hi, Matt. Hi, Brian and Quita. Yeah, residents are happy about the announcement. Before that announcement, they were unable to power wash their driveways or wash their cars with hoses. Now they can. This is something Buck Turnage hasn't been able to do for a while. Feels good, man. Long time coming. Turnage and other Kyle residents were under a stage three water restriction for about a year. Having the water restriction lifted is awesome. It's, it's been tough, especially this being such a new neighborhood. Um, the young lawns need a lot of water, and so those restrictions have hurt us. But just you know, not being able to power wash our houses, the, the cars, having some of those things lifted just so we can do more at home, I mean, it makes a lot of sense. Those restrictions lifted Monday. City leaders say in large part because residents followed the rules and conserved. That's one of the things I love about Kyle. It's just the, the community feel, right? You know, if, if they ask us to do something, we're going to do it, especially if it's be for the betterment of the community. Huge. Yeah, we, we, we ask a lot of our residents and, it's, and it's, um, it's just because of the drought. Mike Murphy is Kyle's director of water utilities says they're able to relax some of the restrictions as they get into the cooler parts of the year. City currently gets water from sources including the Guadalupe Blanco River Authority and the city of San Marcos, which provides 500 acre feet per year. But Murphy says they'll get a whole lot more water with the deal with Alliance Water starting in February. It's gonna provide us an additional 21% of what our, our current capacity um, is, which is, is big for the city of Kyle. And then in 2027, We've got an additional 2 million gallons coming in per day, um, and we're, we're working on um, the uh, take points for that right now. And avoid losing water to leaky infrastructure. Crew is currently working on piping and a storage tank. The way Kyle's growing, we're not getting any smaller, and it, it's growing at a rapid pace. Murphy says the city hasn't set new water rates for customers yet, but residents will see a water rate increase. We're good. We're working hard on water. Trying to add more water resources in a city that's growing and changing. And once again, that deal with Alliance will go into effect in February. Reporting live in Kyle, Matt Fernandez, KV News.